Oh, welcome back guys. Today I have a Meyer and Aldi grocery haul. I did go to Kroger again to try and get the ribs and the watermelon, but they didn't have either one of them, so I was unable to get that. I spent $22.24 at Aldi on food and $0.74 on non-food, and then at Aldi, I, or at Meyer, I spent $17.86. So here are the totals. That brings my total spending on food up to $245.33 and leaves me with $154.76. And my non-food spending is up to $63.21. So let me show you what I got. First I'll start over here with Meyer. This was $17.86. I got two more gallons of water for the ice maker. Just trying to build up a small stash. I got this Meyer Crystal Quenchers. This is the mango and passion fruit. It's just like a sparkling water. And I had a coupon for that. I got a pack of the Meyer Chipsters chocolate chip cookies. I had a coupon for those. And then I also got a bag of the Meyer Extra Wide Egg Noodles. My mom gave me a coupon for these that was for a free bag. I got one pound of unsalted butter. I had a coupon for $1.50 off that. I got several things of cheese. I had a coupon for a dollar fifty off when you spend eight dollars on cheese, I believe it was. And these were on sale for a dollar eighty eight piece, so I needed to get five total to use that coupon. And I also had forty cents off sliced cheese. So I got two of the thick cut Mexican cheese. My toddler calls that baby cheese, and it's the cheese that she likes to eat. And then I got one thing of pepper jack cheese. I plan on using this in the banana peppers I'm growing in the garden. I like to mix sausage and pepper jack cheese, cooked sausage and pepper jack cheese together and then grill them and eat them that way. And then I got two packs of thin sliced provolone cheese. We use this for sub sandwiches. Also got a thing of Land O'Lakes honey butter. So yeah, I got the Land O'Lakes honey butter. I like to have that on toast or bagels. And then I got a gallon of milk. Obviously, this one is from Kroger, but I didn't feel like going out to the other fridge to get the one from Meyer. So it's just a placeholder. That's everything I got at Meyer for $17.86. And then next up is Aldi. I spent $22.24 there, and this is what I got. I got a can of crescent rolls so that I can make pigs in a blanket for my younger two children when we have ribs. I got a can of cinnamon rolls just to have on hand, some lettuce for sub sandwiches and tacos. I got a box of the strawberry fruit strips. I got some real bacon bits. I got two avocados for guacamole, a cantaloupe, a loaf of bread, a thing of cilantro, and then I got three pack of garlic. I also got three pounds of strawberries. This is what's left after a couple days. And they mold really, really fast. As you can tell, they don't look very good now. And after the first night, there was some mold here already. And then my one non-food item, which cost 74 cents, was actually this rain jacket that I got for my toddler. It was the only one they had in the store. I would have preferred the girly one because the pink ones had butterfly wings. And these are just blue camo. But it's just a rain jacket. And she doesn't care what it looks like. It's still a little bit big. But it was on clearance for $0.69, cents, and I just couldn't leave it on the store shelf. And that's everything I got at Aldi for $22.24. Everything you see here was $40.75. If you liked this video, give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification to get notifications when I post new videos. And until next time, we'll be seeing you. Bye, guys!